Hey YouTube, uh, CivicKid96 here, back with a uh, another sneaker lookup. Um, this uh, pickup uh, is obviously here. It, the video I'm going to be looking at this shoe, the Barkley Posit Max Premium Quick Strike. Uh, this is a size 10, and it retailed for 250 bucks. Uh, I've got my pair off of Nike NikeStore.com last weekend. Um, for most of you that follow my videos, uh, I'm a 10 and a half at 11, so you're wondering why. This is a size 10. Um, I actually got this for a friend. Um, I am not, you know, I had no interest in the Barkley Posit at all. And I had, uh, you know, I offered to get it for him for a retail plus, you know, a little tip. So basically, you know, it helps to know people who know the shoes that, you know, who've been collecting shoes for a while. I've been doing this for almost like 12, 13 years. And there'll be times where I don't want to get every pickup. So usually a week or two I'll be free. Like one week I won't pick up anything. So if you guys want me to try to get you things, uh, we can work something out. But I'm not making this a, a big advertisement on YouTube. It's just I tend to help people out uh, when they need to. But anyway, let's get into the shoes. Enough of me, me rambling. As you can see, Nike Sportswear Area 72 Top Secret. Nike, highly classified technology. Every one of the... Um, all-Star Shoes had this sticker. Um, pretty nice touch and give it that uh, special look. Again, Nike Sportswear. And with every box, every shoe that came out in the All-Star Pack, as you can see, let me try to fold it out a little bit, the swoosh Sentinel. There's a nice nice bit of paperwork or paper that came with each pair of shoes. It's really cool. It's like an old school like newspaper article talking about what's going on in Area 72, what, what dropped in that flap. And there you can see the infamous uh, Ray Gun logo or mascot from the All-Star Game. Uh, he debuted in uh, 2005 with Nike SB, and I still have that hoodie today. And there's pretty much more stuff, more articles. But let's get to the main event here. And let's flap. And there you see it. From Barkley Max. Let me go ahead and pull this out. I'm going to shoot the time. There's that. And the second shoe. Do that just right there. Just do that there. And put this aside. Again, this is not my pair. This pair is for a buddy of mine. And there it is. Okay. We can go over it a little bit. I mean, there's a lot of reviews. I'm just going to do a quick look. There you see the Ray Gun logo on the tongue. And you see the laces there, speckled space age laces i guess to match the uh the side panels and the uh, shoe itself side view there you see this actually came with the tag as you can see cwb 1963 leads alabama usa is probably an homage to charles barkley and he is from leeds you know leeds alabama and this was the only shoe i believe in the galaxy pack that had the uh, pool tab which was cool it's a cool little touch and there you see, if you pull back there, the the glow on these are crazy. Of course, I'm not going to have an on-feet review or a, uh, you know, glow-in-the-dark picture, but there's plenty of them on the web. Check them out. It is, the detail on this is pretty disgustingly cool. Um, you can check out the back here. Pull it back there, the air on the uh, pull tabs on the back heel. And then you can see the Charles Barkley logo, CB is the trademark. Charles Barkley grabs a rebound pose, swinging his elbows. For those of you youngins who never got to see him play, Charles Barkley was the man, especially down low. He was the only one that gave Jordan a tough time in 93 when they were going after their third title. Um, very infamous there. There you can see the, um, the swoosh here. Orange, real, real sticky out. Again, the nice glow-in-the-dark material here. Okay. Suede. Leather upper. Purple swoosh, maybe a homage to the Phoenix Suns, who knows. And let's see in the inner, you can see the uh, the galaxy or the planet print inside. It's pretty sweet. I'm not going to remove the inside there, but it does say Nike inside the uh, thing there. You can barely see it. And then you can see the 3M. Most of the upper is 3M. So imagine taking a picture with these with a flash. You could kind of see it going off already. But a lot of the, you know, the bottom of the shoe is what really you know a lot of people were looking at which is real cool you know let me see if i could do this correctly here i'm sorry there it is 
the bottom of the soles are glow in the dark and this reminds me of my uh, CB34 pair I had my CB34 pair that I post on Instagram just follow me on Civic 96 it has Sir Charles underneath in the same print this one is one of Sir Charles's famous sayings in his commercials not a role model um, back in the you know, early 90s, late 80s, early 90s with the 76ers, he was pretty much telling everybody, he told parents that basketball people should not be kids' role models. Parents should be role models. It's a, it's a good commercial. Check it out. That's like the height of Nike's uh, advertising campaign back in the day. But, yeah, not a role model in orange, and the rest of it is covered by a clear sole. This is pretty awesome. You know, makes me wish I got a pair, but it was okay. I... There's a lot that were picked up over the weekend, but there you go. That is my little look at the, uh, the basically the Charles Barkley Posit Max Quick Strike that was released on All Star Weekend this past weekend. And uh, thank you very much, guys, for watching my video. Uh, please subscribe at Civic in ninety six. Um, subscribe to my Instagram at Civic in ninety six. I post pictures every day of what shoes I'm wearing, some hidden gems. I collect a lot of shoes. I've been doing it, like I said, 12, 13 years. And uh, this is one shoe that, although a high price tag, is pretty, pretty nicely detailed and looks real rad. All right, guys. Thank you very much for watching, and have a good one.